Hello, welcome to another video. I'm going to be showcasing how to download and use Kernel. Kernel will be in the description of this video if you would like to use it. And I will be using a script after downloaded and that will be in the description as well. Alright, so first of all, you click on the link in the description and it will take you to this page. Alright. Then you need to go to to Windows and turn your and um, your virus off, your virus and threat protection off. Right. So you go out, turn it off, and go back to kernel. And click download, and then we can use. There's a new version, so I'm going to be showcasing how to download that. If you would like to download the other one, it's just the same, but it's all the old functions. But I prefer this one. Alright, alright, so you click on download after you've turned your antivirus off. Um, it'll say that, so you click CTRLGA. It'll, it'll say it's dangerous but it's not because it's an executor and then you click keep dangerous file all right then you click keep anyway and you'll click show in folder and you um double click on it open it um then just wait for it to load So it's loaded, alright? Okay, uh, so and you would have to go on this where it goes home. So you see recent scripts, then you will click plus, and then it would make a script what you double click on. This is where you paste it, alright? So let me just get a script, so I'll be right back. Um, one minute. Uh, please. Ignore that. I'm just finding a random script that I can use. And I'll just do, um, an arsenal one. Alright, so um, if you want to use the script in the description, just go to that and then you can use that. Alright, so um, you would have to go to kernel again, um, then you would um, click on it, click CTRLV after you've got a script. And it's copied, and then you would go to Roblox and be able to just join Arsenal. And then you would join the game, and you would ignore that as my other executor. Alright, uh, you would ignore that, and then you would click. Oh yeah, you need to inject it. So you would see these like plugs. You click that. Oh wait, when it loads, when it loads, you have to wait until it's in the game. I think. Right, yeah, it'll put you in the game. Then you would click on the plugs again, where my mouse is. Oh, not bad. Uh, then you will click on the plugs, like I said, it'll inject.
Let me just turn the volume down again because it's very annoying. Alright, then it would say enter a key. Alright, so you see this thing here where it says please get a key here. And you will go to that, copy it, ctrlc obviously, and then go to your browser. Google is recommended. Then paste it in your, paste it, copy and paste it, and then enter. And then you just follow the steps. It'll t it'll take a bit, but yeah, just um, copy all the steps. Like this, just go to these. And by the way, when you have done this once, you keep the key forever so you don't need to do it again unless you reinstall it. I think, but yeah, so it's good, but it takes a while at first. But when you've done it, you could just keep using it, keep using it, and it's sick, it's good. So Alright, do the same thing again, simple. Alright, five seconds. This is the only process I hate about it. If it was just one of them, it'd be alright, but it's three of them. But when you get it, at least you keep it. One more. I think let's do this quick, same thing again. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh never mind, there's another. Just keep doing these captures and then the link the ties. Yeah, this is the last one. I'm sure it is. Yeah, it is because it says kernel key. Five, four, three, two, one. I just want to make sure then you could just do the same thing as me while you're doing it on your computer. Alright, and then it will give you a key, alright? The key would only work for me, so don't try to copy it. Just do it yourself. You don't want to risk getting banned from kernel. Right, okay, and then you close all the tabs, because why not? And then you would go to this thing, and then click at the top, and just copy, paste your key in, enter, there you go, it would be right. Then Cut that, and then you can cut this because it will be injected now because your key will have worked. And cut this. Give it a minute. Wait, I think you click on oh, no, Inject again. Then you go to kernel. And it wants to work for me. Hmm, I don't know, it's not working. Is it working? I don't know. Oh um, no, it's not working, so... Give me a minute. I think it might be taking a while to hold. I don't know. Hmm. Maybe I'll click wrong on this. Just see if it's just that script. 
on that. Oh yeah, it's just a script then. I'll um, put a different script in the um, description. But yeah, uh, the script is working. Cause look, I clicked on Infinity Yield and it came up. So that's how you do it. And just paste script in, then it would put it on your robot game. Crap. I'm gonna find um I'm gonna find a screen out real quick. And then I'll do a little showcase and then I'll be done. Alright, hold on one second. Just to show that uh, it works on every game, it's not just a I think I've got one in my folder. Yeah, I have. Yep. Seems to be working. Let me just showcase my game again. Right, and then you'll go to the scan, click on that, uh, paste the different scripts in. This is going to be the one that I'm going to put in there. And then um, execute. I don't know actually, this one's not working as well. Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <sighs> I didn't know it was going to be doing this, but. Yes, it is. I'll find one more that will work. Don't worry. I just I go back on, change it to a different one, click on the play thing, and then play. Maybe a button to do it. Might just be the Yeah, um, yeah, it does work. It's just the uh, scripts, but yeah. I'll find one that you can use. Yeah. That's the showcase. You have to find your own script though. Sorry about that, it's just a script because I did it on uh, the community one, I did Infinity Yield and it works instantly. So yeah, have fun with it.